Modernization project is kind of an all-encompassing term that we use that includes all of the advancements we're making not only to uh, the way that we monitor the use of electricity and water, the way we bill for the electricity and water, but also it's upgrading the infrastructure and the systems that carry both the water and the, uh, and the electricity. So one of the bases is that we have is our automated metering system. We not only automated our electric meters, and we have about 85,000 electric meters, we automated all of our water meters too. Uh, there, while there have been other agencies that have done primarily the electric, at the time we did it, we were one of the first agencies that, that automated our water system. So we got that in place, and then from there we began to build. We, we built our, our billing system off of that, um, and that was really kind of the, the, the foothold that we got. And once we did that, we've begun to now be able to, to implement programs that are associated with the automated metering that help our customers. So you can monitor your water use and your electric use right on your personal phone. You can pay your bill. You can send us a complaint. You can tell us how good we're doing. <laughs> Whatever you want to do can be done from your phone. And obviously from your laptop, from your, from your home computer. Uh, so that whole integration uh, is, 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 is moving very quickly now. Now that we got the, the, the basic fundamental foundation, if you will, in, we're really starting to push forward on these, on these features that, that are really what the customer can take advantage of. I've been really impressed with Glendale Water and Power about how they've been able to empower uh, customers in the, in the neighborhood with information. I mean, they're, they're really innovative with about, about how they get their information out. Whether it's um, through portals, whether it's through apps, I mean, you can pay your bill in a 7-Eleven if you want to. Um, you can really get a hold of your energy information and make choices. I take advantage of everything they have to offer. I mean, there's, um, it, there's opportunities to get your water information through a portal to compare yourself against other houses in the neighborhood, which has been really helpful for me to understand um, how I'm using water and how, how that's impacting my, both my bill and the neighborhood. Um, I participate in their in-home display program, which has been fantastic, and that allows me to get real-time information about my electricity usage as well as my water usage. So at any point in time, if I want to know how much my air conditioning is costing me, I can just grab my phone or look at my display, and I know, and I know exactly what it's costing me, and I can change my habits um, accordingly. You know, it's important that the data you're putting out is accurate, and that, you, that, that when we're doing all these customer interface, functions that they're getting legitimate good data and that's one of the things with our system that I think I've been most proud of and I had nothing to do with this it's the it's the staff of both both itron and city of Glendale but our reads are phenomenal they're like 99 98 percent accurate on a daily basis well we're really happy that I will tell you is is one of the things that I've been impressed about this whole effort was how the two entities, you know, the company that, that we bought the, the, the equipment from, who can really just say thank you, it was nice doing business with you, and, you know, call us if you're ever in need of something again. That's not the case. And they're still here. They're still here helping us because it's as important to them as it is to us that, that we succeed. Probably have a big focus for the next few years on the infrastructure, so getting that all in line and then continuing to add the customer interface as we see them, whether those are our smartphone apps, or, or ways that we can get people more involved in their own management of their systems. And obviously, as we go forward, not only uh, you know, nationwide, but certainly in California specifically, a huge push towards the whole renewable energy uh, drive and, and, and building our portfolio with renewables and, and integrating that into the system as well. So that's where our next really big push is. So the business model for utilities is changing, especially in California, you know, a big, transmission-based electrical utilities are now going to, to renewable energy. A lot of that renewable energy, especially in California, is behind the meter right here, distributed generation. It's rooftop solar. It's, and so we have to learn how to deal with that and integrate that into our system. So that's really where our push is gonna be for the future. And then bringing the metering system and the whole automated system and the whole customer interface system with us. Mm -hmm.